So we're back and the process is almost complete. It's updating the system. So when you see this, uh, you have to pause for a while, all right? You don't actually do a print test page, but just go hit next and finish. All right. So the next thing we have to do in order to successfully configure the wireless direct function, you have to turn on the Wi-Fi feature of the SCX printer before you can actually use it. So to do that, please go to Start, All Programs, Samsung Printer, and there you will see this folder called Easy Printer Manager. Go ahead and run the application. Here, uh, please choose where it says the advanced mode. And you will see that the printer is right there. Okay? So, guys, this is the most important part of the process because if you don't actually do this, the Wi Fi direct feature will not be turned on, so you cannot use it. Alright? So, where do we go to configure? how to turn the Wi-Fi feature on. Go to device settings. Very quickly, uh, change the power save button to the longest so it doesn't keep on going to sleep mode. So hit save. And then here, you can now go to where it says network. And scroll, if it's not maximized, scroll to the right. So you can scroll down and look over here. It says Wi-Fi direct mode is, what does it say? It's off. So you have to turn that on. And you can also change the password here. You know, if you're already uh, doing this for the first time, it might have a different pass default password. But we changed it so it's eight ones. All right. You can change also the IP address or device name. But we'll leave it as it is. So as long as you turn it on, that's fine. And now you can hit it, hit save. And now you say OK to save the settings. And your Wi-Fi settings are now on. Now I will show you the next part of the process.